You want to talk to me? After everything you've done? Sorry, I'm afraid I can't help you much right now. I'm currently in mourning. It was my sister, Lilia. She served as a battle maiden with the storm cloaks. We recently heard she'd been killed. I... I find it difficult to talk about. Perhaps you'd be better off speaking to my parents about it. Anyway, I'm glad my work at the Black Briar Meadery keeps me busy. Helps me keep my mind off of things. My father was a Stormcloak soldier in his younger days. Now he just walks the streets spewing his hatred and propaganda. My mother is the priestess of Talos. She tends to the shrine and teaches his ways. I'm just not so sure she's delivering the right message. Don't mistake my political beliefs as a substitute for my family values. They're still my parents, and I love them dearly. I just think they've let my sister's death skew their outlook on Ulfric and what he really brings to the table with this war. I'm not so certain that Ulfric's intentions are as noble as they think. I think Ulfric cares about Ulfric, and the rest is a smokescreen. I'd appreciate if you kept my opinion between us. The last thing I want to do is have my parents lose another child. Yes, actually. I'm partnered with Maven Blackbriar. I put up a chunk of the gold she needed to get the place off the ground. We've been staggeringly successful so far. In fact, I'm almost surprised how quickly she's generated business for us. My name may not be on the label, but some of my blood, sweat, and tears are in every drop. Figuratively, of course. It's been good talking to you. It's been good talking to you. It fills us with rage. What harm does it bring to us now? You have some nerve coming back here after what you did to Kirava. Three, in fact. They're my own recipe. Brought them over here from my days as a bartender in Gideon. First is the Velvet Lachance, which is a mixture of blackberry, honey, spiced wine, and a touch of nightshade. Perfectly safe, I assure you. Second, we have the White Gold Tower, which is heavy cream with a layer of blended mead, lavender, and dragon's tongue on top. Last, and only for the bravest of souls, we have the Cliff Racer, which is firebrand wine, cyrodylic brandy, flynn, and Sujama. Just get out of here. I don't like talking to someone who holds their honor so cheaply. Indeed, there have been multiple attempts on the Jarl's life. We're not certain if it's the Dark Brotherhood or simply Imperial sympathizers. We've also had run-ins with spies attempting to probe our security for weaknesses. I work with the city guard to make certain they fail. At the end of the day, I'm the last line of defense for the Yar. I will not allow her to fall. He's taking the Empire to task and making them answer for their crimes. I don't think I'll be content until Ulfric sits upon the throne of Skyrim with the ashes of the Concordat at his feet. All I need is a dozen men, and we could march into the Ratwe and burn them out like rodents. Stormcloaks won't have it, though. Too busy keeping the Imperial forces at bay. Everyone knows the Thieves' Guild uses the old sewer system beneath Riften as their hideout. I'd go down there myself, but that would leave Yara Leila unprotected. I'm keeping my eye on you. You, what do you want? Watch your feet. We just clean there. Yes? For Falkreath and I, this is just one more war in a long line. I hope the Wilds claim you one of these days. For Valkreath and I, this is just one more war in a long line. What do you need? Dark times indeed. I fear the worst for Morthal and my people. Here to shame an old woman? Leave me be. I try and take comfort in knowing that when all is lost, there is much to be gained. It is my hope that I will one day return to Hialmarch, but the Divines have not shown this to me. Yes? Yes? What is it that you want? Work? 
I demand tribute before you can be considered for any real tasks. You better. I hate people who waste my time. Come and see me again sometime. I might have some use for you. Something you need, you miserable wretch. The Stormcloaks want freedom, but don't understand its price. There are opportunities everywhere. Why don't you go find them? No time. I have business to conduct. Stand aside. I don't need to speak to you. The Stormcloaks want freedom, but don't understand its price. There are opportunities everywhere. Why don't you go find them? No time. I have business to conduct. Yes, yes, I haven't got all day. There are so many delightful ways I've pictured you dead. Yes. Speak. <coughs> I don't mean you any trouble. Just leave me alone. Be warned. The Jarl is hmm. in a foul mood since the Stormcloaks overran Whiterun. Yes. The task of steward is more important than you realize. The Jarl often asks for my invaluable counsel. Yes. Hmm? What do you want, milk drinker? No doubt he thought it was the only way to make his point. And also, because he knew he could. Ulfric Stormcloak's head on a pike. Do you think Ulfric really cares about Skyrim's independence or the welfare of its people? I promise you, he doesn't. He's nothing more than a barbarian renegade whose lust for power has cost the lives of countless innocents. Next time, deal with Avenici. I don't understand. Why can't we go home? I hope monsters come and eat you. I can't sleep here. The dreams are even worse than before. Yes? The only grown-ups who talk to me are the kind I don't want talking to me. Have I done something Need to something? make you bother me? Yes? I don't like talking to someone who holds their honor so cheaply. Need something? Yes? Mortal doesn't need any trouble. You keep your nose clean, understand? All this standing around is rush. Marker. We should be taken to fight to the storm clothes. Hi there. Leave Idgrid and her family alone. They've been through enough. <coughs> this wasn't what I wanted. Not at all. All that ever mattered was what was best for Morthal. Leaving it in Ulfric's hands. It's not right. I'm just here to protect the Jarl, not to chat. Morthal has enough problems without you bothering me. I'm under a lot of pressure. If you don't leave me alone, I won't be held responsible. Yes? Need something? You're mean. I hate you. I hate you forever and ever and ever. Please don't mind Yorick. He's not mad. Really, he's not. You. Every time I look at you, my blood boils. To be driven from our homes. To be forced here. This is the last thing that Yorick needs. I don't... I haven't Mother's Gift. Not quite. But I've seen things. I keep hoping this is another vision. That it's not real. But it is, isn't it? We really have lost our home. For now, looking after Yorick is my job. Hmm? Father says I'm too young to train with the sword, so I practice with my fist. Hope this war lasts long enough that I get to fight in it. Battle! Glory! You're not from around here. I bet you're here to help with the war. Yes? Stormcloaks have taken the reach, but will return. The Empire will bring order. What do you want? Haven't you done enough damage to Markarth? I'm waiting. Just looking at you makes me upset. I can't believe we lost Markarth. Hmm? Igman's family has ruled there for generations. I don't think we have anything to discuss, Stormcloak. Hmm? Need something? Igmund is alive, and I'll keep it that way, Jarl or not. Yes? You have something to say, dog? Something on your mind? Need something? Need you something? lay one finger on Igmund, and I'll end you, Stormcloak. Hi there. Need something? Well, hello. Yes? 
Leave We're safe Ygritte here now. And her family what alone? of Morthal? They've been through enough. The Empire brought stability, assurance to the people of Morthal, even if they didn't appreciate it. Now what do they have? I fear for what this change will do to my family. I'm waiting. Yes. Dark times indeed. I fear the worst for Morthal and my people. Something you need, you miserable wretch. Yes? What is it that you want? Now that's what I like to see. Someone who gets things done. Here, a little something for you. Come and see me again sometime. I might have some use for you. Good to see you. Finally, someone useful is around. The Stormcloaks want freedom, but don't understand its price. There are opportunities everywhere. Why don't you go find them? Stand aside. I don't need to speak to you. The Stormcloaks want freedom, but don't understand its price. There are opportunities everywhere. Why don't you go find them? Speak. Need something? Got a lot of steel to shape. I don't think so. I'm sure my brother Vigna is, since they made him Jarl after throwing Balgrove out. Comes the end of the day, Imperials and Stormcloaks ain't that much different. Both sides want to tell you how you should live your life. Guess I'd rather hear it from a real Nord than some Emperor down south. We done? Hmm? Alright then. I ain't much for talking. Mm-hmm. Why are you still staring at me? All right then. Until next time. Did you know there are some fruits that actually grow better in the cold weather? You mean, I hate you. I hate you forever and ever and ever. You'd be surprised how much work it is selling things at a stall. It's not all standing around and chatting. Hi there. I hope monsters come and eat you. Well, I used to sneak out at night and try to tip over the big ox in the Grey Mane's yard. And me and Mila used to climb up on the roof of Dragon's Reach and look for bird's eggs. But I don't do that stuff anymore. Father keeps catching me and then I get in trouble. Mm-hmm. It was you, wasn't it? I should have known better. Now look at me. You've sent an innocent man to jail. I hope you're proud of yourself. Maven be damned. One day she'll get hers. I can promise you that. Leave me alone. Haven't you done enough damage already? Yes, yes, I haven't got all day. Make it quick. Yes. When the Stormcloaks took control of Whiterun, it was a victory for all true Nords. You. Every time I look at you, my blood boils. I take my duties as Housecarl very seriously. I won't hesitate to shed blood if my uncle Vignar is threatened. What's the matter? You can't stand the sight of a strong Nord woman? I miss the days when the Grey Manes and Battleborns got along. Ever since the war started, we've been at each other's throats. There's nothing a man can do that I can't do better, whether it's serving drinks or slaying trolls. The daughters of this land are just as strong and loyal as its men. You wouldn't know it now. But the Grey Manes and Battleborns were once fast friends. Oh, did you need something? Leave me alone. Can't an old man have some peace? Of course they have. I've made no secret of my loyalty to the Empire. I'm no coward. Twice I've been robbed, and good luck getting any kind of justice from Vignar now that he is the Jarl. He probably told the Storm close to do it. Lately, they've been threatening to send my whole family into exile if we're caught collaborating with the Empire. They think we're spies. Well, needless to say, these rebels and I have no love for each other. Uncivilized pelt-wearing axe-draggers. It's a wonder they don't still live in a cave like those ancestors they keep boasting about. It's true. Vignar Greymane and his lot are one of Whiterun's oldest and, depending on who you ask, most respected clans. I don't dispute that. But it's one thing to take pride in your lineage, and another to cling blindly to the 
past. What they call honor and tradition, I call ignorance. Money, you laggard. What else? It always comes down to coin. The Grey Manes have deep roots in White Run, but so do we. Difference is, we're rich. <laughs> and Vignar hates it. Oh, and they hate it too. All their big talk of pride and honor. What have they got to show for it? Beggars rags and stale bread. We've got the same pride, the same honor, and we've got wealth. No wonder they envy us. Battleborn is a name out of legend, sung in songs of old and heard in deeds of valor for a hundred generations. For Clan Battleborn, they cry in the mead halls, first into the fray and last to quit their ale. We've got honor, wealth, and titles too. I and buxom women to warm your bed on a cold Skyrim night. Now, if that don't answer your question, then no words will. You watch yourself out there. I hope the Empire is sending reinforcements to drive these heathens out of White Run. Keep your eyes open for those storm cloaked dogs, eh? Old friend. Patron of the great clan Battleborn. A name I'm sure you know well. All right. The gods know what you've done. Grace of Kinnereth be with you.